I'm Bianca Renee, and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today I'm coming at you barefaced, no makeup, because I'm gonna show you my updated skincare routine. So pretty much you could say I've temporarily joined the Alicia Keys movement for the sake of this video. Now because I decided to do a skincare routine, of course Mother Nature found out and decided to show up right on the middle of my face. So I'm gonna show you how to get rid of her. Now not too much has changed in my daily skincare routine, but I have got the new and improved Ultimate Skin Spa. So this is an updated version of the spin brush that I've shown you in my previous videos. Now the other one is called Spin for Perfect Skin. This one is called Ultimate Skin Spa, also from Vanity Planet. So let's do a quick little unboxing for you. And the first thing you will notice is that, well, don't, yeah. Now the first thing you'll notice is that it comes in a cute little travel case. Now I have been doing a lot of traveling. I must say that my Spin for Perfect Skin Brush, I used it every day, morning and night, and I didn't know where to put it or how to pack it. So the fact that this comes in a cute little traveling case has been amazing. Now inside this case, you also get three brushes as well as the actual Spin Brush. So here is the new Spin Brush. Here is the old spin brush. Already, you could see that it's a little bit smaller in length, but a little bit wider. And the other one has a smaller circular bristle, and this one is much larger. And the bristles are even softer and better for more sensitive skin. If you thought the other brush still wasn't sensitive enough for your sensitive skin, this one will definitely work for you. The second brush head option is for exfoliating. So this one is a little bit rougher and it gets that really good deep clean. Now as you can see with the sensitive brush, the bristles are really, really soft and bend really easy. When I first used it, I almost thought it was too soft, like I was just rubbing my face with feathers but it really is good for sensitive skin. Now if you compare it to the exfoliating brush, it's a little bit more rough. See how they don't bend as much? So you're getting a little bit more exfoliation than you would with the sensitive one. And last but not least is this silicone bristled brush. When I first saw this in the box, I was like, what is that? I'm never gonna use it. It looks too intense. And now it's actually my favorite brush out of the three. So this one's really good at getting into your pores and I have super large pores and the silicone bristles are still soft enough to where it doesn't irritate my skin but gives you a little bit more aggression to really get in those pores. Now besides the fact that I'm loving one, the travel case and the three new types of brushes, the main thing that I think you guys are going to love is that there's two different speeds on here. So you have the first one, goes at a pretty normal rate, and then you push it again, and now it's twice as fast, giving you an even deeper clean. So I do really enjoy having the medium and the fast speed options. So you can choose whatever works for your skin. So those are all the main things I think you need to know about the brush itself. It does require batteries, but it is waterproof. I always use my spin brush in the shower. It can get wet, I wouldn't just like drop it in the tub, but it is okay to be used in the shower. I use it in the shower in the daytime and just in the sink at night. Now the entire Ultimate Skin Spa, the brush, three brush heads, and the cool traveling case, it's $125. But I'm not gonna let you spend $125 because I have a 70% off promo code for you guys, so that makes it only $38. Much better. So now let me show you exactly how I wash my face. So the first thing that I would do if I had a full face of makeup on is wipe my makeup off with face wipes. These are by Neutrogena. These are pretty much everybody's favorite. That way you get all the majority of your makeup off and you don't stain your brushes with all the makeup. It's just a good first step so you don't have too much cleaning to do with your brushes. After you wipe off all your makeup, I'm going to then rinse my face with warm water. I'm gonna try to do this, but the sink's over there, the camera's over here, so I'll be right back. All right, now that my face is wet, I'm going to apply what I still use, which is the Oxy Rapid Treatment Face Wash. This is really good for acne prone skin. I've been using it for a while now. Now I like to apply the product to my face. This is on wet skin, mind you. Get it all in there. And then I use my brush. I tried applying the product to the brush first, but then it just kind of splat all over the place, especially with this faster speed. I don't want my product all on the wall. So I like to put on my skin first, and then I grab my brush. First I'm gonna use the sensitive brush, and this one is a little bit damp. You don't want it to start off with a dry brush. Get it wet, put it on the actual spin brush, 
and then start to spin. Here's the first speed. Nice, easy, slow pace. And if you feel like you want it to be a little bit stronger, go ahead and push it one more time. There we go. Now we're cleaning. So I just like to do in a circular motion on top of the circular motion that it's already doing. And just do it on your whole face. Alrighty, after you use this, you're going to take it off and you're gonna clean this with soap and water. You don't wanna keep all the bacteria on here and make you break out from using your brush. So make sure you clean your brushes after every use. And just because I like it, I'm gonna now use the silicone brush to get an even deeper clean into my pores. I don't know why I like this one so much. I just feel like it's like really getting in there. Once you feel like your skin is completely scrubbed, I'm now going to rinse my face with cool water to close my pores. And once you've rinsed your face, it's gonna pat dry. Oh, then washed off my edge control. After my face is completely clean, it's feeling so fresh, but it's so clean we want to now lock it with a moisturizer. So I'm gonna be using my oil-free moisturizer by Neutrogena. I've been using this for years now. So just gonna apply this to our skin in a nice circular motion. Ah, feels so fresh. Now like I mentioned before, I do have that promo code down below for you to get 70% off, making it only $38. So for $38, you get the brush, the three brush heads, the traveling case, and beautiful skin. I have very acne prone skin. I am always breaking out. But as you can see, my skin is so much better than maybe my earlier videos you guys have noticed. And it really does give me a clear complexion and it really does help with acne. If you have acne prone skin, I would definitely recommend the softer sensitive skin brush. And then maybe later on, try the exfoliating one maybe once a week. But it really is depending on your skin type and they give you three options and two speeds so you can play around with it and find what works best for your skin type. So that is everything I have to say about the Ultimate Skin Spa Brush. This is my new updated skin routine. If you guys wanna be updated on a more frequent basis on what I do with my hair and my skin, make sure you follow me on Snapchat at Ms. Bianca Renee, because I give you guys all the exclusives there. And go ahead and subscribe. I post new videos every Sunday, and I'm really trying to get to 100,000 subscribers by the end of this year, so please subscribe and tell a friend. I will see you guys next week. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.